We might have a conversation if you hide that weapon. What do I owe the pleasure? Well, well, I seldom see a new face here. So, what would you like to know? Yes, he visited us. He knew a great deal, far more than others. <laughs> he even claimed to have been to the center of the zone. Naturally, I didn't really believe him, even though he showed me some photographs. We made a deal with him. He promised to conduct field testing on one of our promising experimental models, a Psi emission blocker. And we promised to give him the final version in return. Strelog believed that the blocker would help him get through the brain scorcher. We gave him the prototype, and he went into the factory. That was the last we saw of Strelok and the prototype. We received some data via our satellite, but the signal has been lost. It looks like Strelok was hit by a powerful emission at the factory. If Strelok is in the factory, getting inside without a Psi protection device is virtually impossible. We have been studying the Psi emissions originating from the factory for years. They have a pronounced pulse nature. When they are in their low phase, people go into the factory relatively safely. However, we are unable to predict when the next emission will take place, so going inside is like playing Russian roulette. If you decide to follow Strelok into the factory, you will most likely end up with your brains melted like most of the zombies around here. There is something which I may be able to do for you, however. Some time ago, I was contacted by a group of stalkers who managed to come out of the factory alive. They came across a technical documentation archive in one of the buildings. Those documents could shed light on what the factory contains and help us uncover the source of such powerful psi emissions. Help me find those documents and I'll help you get inside the factory. The group went missing in the northwestern part of the facility. That area is full of zombies. I cannot send any stalkers who are guarding the perimeter, seeing as we're barely holding out against the attacks as it is. The SOS signal coming from there is still active, so please try to get the stalkers out if they're still alive. It's the deserted factory. It draws stalkers like a magnet because it is one of the few buildings they haven't reached yet. They say very rare artifacts and valuable equipment can be found inside. So stalkers keep trying to get in, hoping to strike gold. The trouble is that it's like playing Russian roulette. The Psi field is extremely unstable. When it peaks, the emissions can melt a human brain in seconds. They 
have been giving us problems from the day this laboratory was set up. The walls are strong, but the howling and other racket from the outside is awfully disruptive. As you can imagine, carrying out research or even sleeping under these conditions is no easy task. On top of that, sometimes we have to leave the bunker to collect samples. We spent a long time considering this issue. Regardless of how much effort the military expended on clearing out the facility, zombies would always come back. It all became clear when a former assistant of mine, who went missing while taking measurements by the factory, was discovered among the zombies. It's the Psy Field. Everyone who is affected by it loses his mind and turns into a zombie. This happens as a result of irreversible damage to the higher functioning of the human brain. Ergo, these creatures cease being human. They have no cognitive abilities, and so their behavior is the result of whatever remains of their purely animal instincts. Best wishes!
Don't be a jerk, holster your weapon! What up, brother? I'm all ears.
What's new, Stalker? This is Chekhov. If you still want to join us, come see me at the Freedom Base. Freedom is ready to accept you into its ranks. What's up, Chief?
We can't wait for you forever! Get over here! to a gunfight, fools! Oh, is this ever going to end? Yeah. 
only free people on Earth. To fighting the big space. ones. Come by our base so we can fight you properly. It will no longer bother us in our fight against the zone. Congratulations to all those who contributed to this momentous victory.
want to earn the respect of fellow stalkers? Do you want to build a team of loyal friends who will stick up for you in times of trouble? Do you dream of kicking some duty ass? All this and many other opportunities awaits you if you join freedom. and rookies. If you value your freedom and want to be among others like you, join us. Freedom welcomes everyone who has trodden the zone's path to our doors. Become a freedom member! Together, we will save the zone! The only group of truly free people on Earth! You cold dudes and cold-blooded comrades! 
If you're looking to be appreciated and treated like family, that's freedom all the way. There's no chores, no brainwashing, and no morning wake-up thrills. If you're a real stalker who loves the free life and a good drink in the company of like-minded fellas, join right in. We've always got old booze for new blood.